the bronze tickets for Clash of the Legends 2. You got free fireworks to the first 1,000 fans in attendance That's on right. July 1st. You got free barbecue. You got live music. What are you talking about? Well, first of all, Corey Macklin, you didn't even tell the people what we're talking about. <sighs> Clash of the Legends 2. It's going to be Friday, big. July 1st. Where's it going to be? The Soto Civic it? Center. It's going to be big. Free barbecue. Jimmy Hart's already got the popcorn cranked up here because there's a $3 combo, combo. man. Three dollar combo hot dog, popcorn, and coke, right, Hart? Hot dog, popcorn, and coke for three bucks. You can't beat that anywhere, baby. Now, what were you talking about? Jimmy Hart's out here making fun because uh, you want to talk about me inviting you to the Redbirds game and all of that stuff, and then me saying, oh, I bought you the tickets, and I treated him to the tickets, try to do him a good deed. This, was, of course, was years ago. Before I ever even associated well, well, with you two quick. guys. He, he said, Jimmy, won't you fly to Memphis before our TV show? You yeah. know the deal. I flew down. He said, look, I'll get the, I'll get the tickets to the Red Birch. You, you go to the concession and get the food. I went there. It cost me more for the concessions. Did you get right. the ball game? What a ripoff. Well, not man. at DeSoto County. Not no, at DeSoto not Civic there. Center. No, it's going to be big. A lot of big names. We're going to be telling you all about that today. we got great action today on opening the vaults of Memphis Classic Wrestling. You guys want to tell them we got PYT Express. And Midnight Express, right? Oh, all sorts of action today on the show. And one thing I'm excited about, Renee, guess who? Apparently, are they here? Are they here? Do you know, Corey Macklin? The Hillbillies. The Hillbillies will be here today. That's right. We're going to see them live on TV today. Jimmy. The new Scuffling Hillbillies. UPN, yeah. a new reality show. Have they picked up the Beverly Hillbillies now? Oh, UPN? Oh, I'm oh, telling you, these Hillbillies are from Mississippi, though. Oh. I can't wait to see them. I just, you know what? I just hope that we don't have to smell them. They look great. We're going to have footage of Dirty Dutchman Tail Ravishing Rick Rude in the match coming up today. We're going to talk to the Dirty Dutchman a little bit later on today. He's going to be there July 1st oh, at yeah. DeSoto Civic Center as well. And we got footage of this classic, classic footage with Andy Kaufman involving you, Jimmy Hart, in the ring against Kaufman. And not only that, King it Lawler. later spilled to Jerry the King Lawler and Andy Kaufman on the David Letterman show. You remember that, Lawler? Sure, I put David Letterman on the map. I've made oh, so many goodness. people stars, haven't I? Can we get on with it? Can we yeah. take a look yep. at no. Let's take a break. The Homer Skeleton 4 Clash of the Legends 2 is going to be big July 1. We'll be back to tell you all about that and much more. Stay right there. Zip it. The heroes, the villains, the legends. Clash of the Legends 2. Friday, July 1st at the Soto City Center. Free fireworks given away. Live music entertainment. Gold ticket holders get a free barbecue dinner with the legends. The legends. Clash of the Legends 2. Tickets on sale now for Clash of the Legends 2. Friday, July 1st at the State of the Art DeSoto Civic Center. The Legends return to Memphis Wrestling for one night only. Friday night, July 1st. Start the new era. Don't miss it. Looking for the best deal? Shopping the paper for the best price on a new car or truck? Play it smart. Take any print ad on a new Ford and simply put Homer Skelton's name on it. Because their ad is Homer's ad. That's right. Take any ad for a new Ford to Homer Skelton Ford and Homer will beat it by at least 250 Guaranteed. <laughs> Largest selection. Lowest prices. Every ad is Homer's ad. Look in every paper you can find. Take their good deal to Homer and he'll beat it by at least $250. Homer Skelton Ford always saves you more. Need a real vacation? Well then, come on in and see the friendly staff at Mid-South Title Loans. We can help make your dream vacation a reality. Just bring in the title to your car and get the cash you need. It's quick, easy, and you keep your car. Plus, it's interest-free for 30 days. Just call 565-0005 for the location nearest you. Let Mid-South Title Loans pack you up for fun in the sun. I saw the vehicle coming. Wow, out of nowhere came this car crashed right into me and crushed my car and my leg. We know car wrecks and how to help you. When I made the call and they took my case, I felt relieved. Pretty pleasant, easy to talk to. The sense of knowing that you're going to get what you deserve. Get top priority with us. Call 683-7000. I made a very good choice by picking Corby Trotz. He went to the moon for me. So he's my kind of man. And here we are back on opening the vaults of Memphis Classic Wrestling. You see this? Jimmy Hart, Jerry Lawler, it's a check for $1,000 that's going to go to a fan at DeSoto Aww. Civic Center. What do you mean, oh, that's Look. great. Some fan, lucky fan is going to win $1,000 in cash from Cash Depot. Why would you put that check up when my video came on the screen just then? Jimmy, let me because tell you something. Wants to see your Corey Macklin must feel, the people down in Mississippi must be so poor 
that must be so destitute. He is trying his best to give the big handout. He's giving away everything. You know what he's lined up? He got one of my main employees fired over Jerry Lawler's fireworks because he went behind my back. Fired? And he got the, now he's giving away to the first thousand Mississippians that come in or first thousand people that come into Soto County Civic Center. They're going to give away a hundred bottle rockets and a hundred firecrackers. Free. And the, Corey Macklin lined that up. Well, let me That's right. That's a did. great thing. Look, I'm bringing, first thousand fans. I'm putting together a great musical tribute for Lance Russell, I'm going to do our big million seller records here, which was Lance Russell's Nose, right. We Hate School, right. Cinema Girl, the list goes on, and I'll tell you about the band later. And, and he goes and gets two other jabroni bands and puts jabroni them out Jabroni band, we got yeah. the CEOs that everybody knows here in CEOs. town. CEOs. <laughs> and Slam Hound is going to be down there, that's right. Get so, ready for your ears to start bleeding. Oh, please, man. It's got to be some rap group knowing him. It's going to be a big night. we got rap, we got rock, we oh. got country. You're going to sing country too, aren't you, Art? Uh, it's going to be a big night. we got free barbecue, free fireworks for the first. Thousand fans, compliments of Jerry Lawler's fireworks at the Soto Civic Center, Friday, July the first. What? You should be happy about that, Lawler. Well, it cost Kevin Bailey his job. I don't know. I don't know if you're happy Man, about I'm that or not. Don't forget, fans, you get a chance to win not only this thousand dollars cash, but we're also giving away this 53-inch television. One of these sets is going to go to Good a lucky grief. fan. July 1st also. Everything's being given away. You know what? I understand you got a guy on the phone that would absolutely give you the hair off his back. Well, I'm going to call him in a minute. I'll tell you what I'm talking about. I'll tell you what I want to do first. We got him in action. I know you're talking about Dirty Dutch Man Tail. Let's see Dutch in action. And yeah, we're going to get him on the phone. We'll be back to that. Let's go and open the vaults now of Memphis Classic Wrestling. Oh, boy. Oh, I used to love to fight Dutch Mantel. I used to love to beat him like the dog that he was and send him back to Oil Trough, Texas with his tail tucked between his legs. Call him on the phone Hello? right yeah, now. Yeah, I'm calling him. I hey, hope you hey, don't how bad I used to beat I him. I hated that bull whip, though. Oh, well, well he still got that bull whip. He used to be in the first family. I, I kicked him out. He shut up, up Art. I'm calling Oil Trough, Texas. Dutch Mantel, are you there? Hello. Dutch, we're, we're, we got you live here in Memphis. How are things down in Oil Trough, Texas, Dutch? How the hell? That's what it is. It's hot down here. Who's there? It's Corey Macklin in Memphis at Memphis Wrestling. Doing there? How are you? <laughs> doing good, Dutchman. There's your picture on the screen, and uh, we're looking forward to seeing you July 1 at the Soto Civic Center, buddy. Okay, tell me, tell me yeah. I got this right. You're giving away some free fireworks. You're doing that? We're giving away free fireworks. Compliments of Jerry Lawler's. Yeah, we are, Lawler. Uh, I'm canceling that. Compliments of Jerry the King Lawler's fireworks. And we're giving away $1,000. We got a bunch of stuff going on, Dutch. They sure do, Dutch. Years ago, and you deserve each other today. And I'm sitting down in Oil Trough, and it's hot. I got a lot of Mexicans around. Now I'm in a bad mood. And when I get to the Soto, Mississippi, I'm going to be in a worse mood because Lord, we're going to step in the ring, and we're going to settle something that never really got settled over the years. It's me and you one more time for another legends match. Let's get it down. Let's get it dirty. And Jimmy, let me tell you something, Mr. Hart. If you want to step in, step in because I got a little surprise for you and Mr. Hart. <laughs> Yeah, I understand you may have somebody in your corner that night. We won't tell them today Dutch who it's going to be. We'll talk about that more. But, hey, Dutchman, good hearing from you here in opening the vaults of Memphis Classic Wrestling. We'll be looking for you July 1st at DeSoto Civic Center. Okay, Lauren, let me tell you, it's going to be a hot July, and it's going to be even hotter in DeSoto, Mississippi. Well, you know what? <laughs> Hang up Thank on you. Da- what? Hang what do you mean? on Dutch Mantel. Hang up on what? Do you know who Dutch Mantel is? Do you remember who I told you that guy is? Dirty Dutch Mantel. Guy that has hair, disgusting hair all over his all body. All over his body, matted hair. Well, I'll tell you what, it is going to be hot. It's not matted hair. Center. You know what, Jimmy? I may bring out, he going to bring out you, baby? Well, I may bring out the old fireball that night. Oh, I and we it. may burn all that nasty, stinking hair right off Dutch's body. Wow. It'll be hotter in DeSoto County Civic Center than it is in Oil Trough, Texas. Oh. The heroes, the villains, the legends. Clash of the Legends 2. Friday, July 1st at the Soto Civic Center. Free fireworks given away. Live music entertainment. Gold ticket holders get a free barbecue dinner with the legends. The legends. Clash of the Legends 2. Tickets on sale now for Clash of the Legends 2. Friday, July 1st at the State of the Art DeSoto Civic Center. The legends return to Memphis Wrestling for one night only. Friday night, July 1st. Start a new era. Don't miss Back on opening the vaults uh, of hey, Memphis hey, Classic hey, hey. Wrestling. Corey Macklin, well, we're I... back, and I'm tired of waiting. 
Renee is tired of waiting. We have been embarrassed. We've been humiliated. Jimmy, you don't even know what's taken place here the last Man, couple of weeks. I just got in town. What's going on? You know that hillbilly family, the Watsons, Grady Watson, who used to buy a ticket and sit out in the audience? From Mississippi. He has that car lot, rental rally car lot. Yeah, well, I don't know oh, what yeah, he does. Oh, yeah, I know that. Oh, come on, hard as right. He doesn't have a car lot. It's not rental rally. Okay. And what, so what? The people are from Mississippi. That's great. What well, about it? here's what happened, Jimmy. Okay, I me. challenged Grady Watson and his whole family to a match. And we're going to add this match now. He accepted. We're going to add this match at the DeSoto County Civic Center on July 1st. Oh, cool. But then Grady Watson, this typical, you know what they, they love down there? They love to eat crawfish. Well, he acts like a crawfish. He starts going oh, backwards. Oh, man. What he's done now is he says, well, he wants us to wrestle his entire family, Jimmy. Cousins. Yeah. His, so they have insurance. Yeah. And you know what? He's they gone down to get his cousin somewhere down. Yeah. Way down in Mississippi. Wait. We, wait, we want to see him. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's go in and get him out of here. Let's get Grady. Will you guys, let's come on. Security, let him in the door over there. Grady, come on in. Oh, come on. Good to see Jimmy, you. Good to see you. Stay right. Hang on over here. Tammy, how are you guys? Yeah. All right. Now, you, Grady, you're getting ready for July 1st, the Soto Civic Center. You're accepting Jerry Lawler's challenge, but he and Renee against a couple of your cousins, right? We got them here today? Yes, sir. Oh, Corey, I just got back from down in Rooster Scratch, Mississippi. What? <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Where at Rooster Scratch, Mississippi? What, what, yeah. i tell you where that is. I've heard of Rooster Scratch. You know, you've heard of Rooster Scratch? Yeah. I have, too. That's when you have to go to the bathroom in the middle of the night. It involves a flashlight and a pair of shoes. <laughs> <laughs> and a corn cob, right? Yes, exactly. <laughs> but I've been driving all day, Corey, but I've got them here today. Well, let me what, say this. What? You've brought your cousins from Rooster Scratch, Mississippi, and this is who Renee and I are going to wrestle, right? And what's their names? Jeff Rowe and May Dean. Do you hear that, Jeffro? Can I say, say this? Great, let me tell Maybe you something. Maybe. This is Jerry Lawler. He will slap you so hard, he'll knock that whole line down over there, baby. Right. Boy. But Jerry, let me tell you something. They don't like to wrestle. They, they don't. don't. No, they don't like to fight, but they love to scuffle. <laughs> scuffle? So, so, are you ready to meet them? Well, no, yes. As a matter of fact, I am ready to meet them, but I got something special in store for them. Since they've come all the way to the big city of Memphis, we wanted to welcome them, right? Didn't we, baby? Yes, we did. We've got some special entrance music. You know what? Oh, when come on, Laura. They play the royal entrance music. Well, we got some special entrance music. Don't be insulting the people. What kind of music is this? Let's go ahead and let's okay, hear it. Okay, here we go. Let's hear it. Don't be insulting. Oh, this is a new story about a man named Jay. Oh. <laughs> Bring him out. Where are they? That's ridiculous. Oh, the Beverly Hills, Billy. Oh. Billy. Billy. oh. There you go. There you go, Lola. There you go, Renee. That's her. That's her. That's her. There you go. She ain't going to be too pretty when I'm through with her. Huh. I guess you heard that, huh? <laughs> From Rooster Scratch, Mississippi, and I, I got a feeling somebody else is going to be scratching back with these. Oh, what? what? Hold on, Mayval. What do you got? You go, she's going to light us. Is that a corn cob pipe? That's right. Is that, uh, what's your name again, Jethro? Is that you I'm smelling, Jethro? Oh, come on, Lawler. Well, I'm going to tell you something. How tall are you? Six foot eight. He's got a heck of a tan, too, King. Six foot eight. Well, let me tell you, hillbilly something. You think you're going to come out here and you think you're going to embarrass Renee and I? She's from Providence, Rhode Island. And I'm from the big city of Memphis, Tennessee. And I'll show you on July 1st exactly what we do to hillbillies like you. Can you get them out of here, Corey Macklin? I'm well, sick of looking at them. Well, you wanted to see them. I'm sick of smelling I've seen enough of Jethro them. Jethro and Maybell, thank you so much. We'll Grady, see you we. in the Soto Center. You're going to pay for this, Grady Watson. You think you've pulled another fast one, Grady? You are going to pay for this, I promise you. How <laughs> you like that? <laughs> you think that's funny, Corey Macklin? I love it. I love it. How big, yeah, was, those, how big was that? Six foot eight, about three hundred. Because he lives in Mississippi well, now. Well, what about you, Hart? You were you born in Mississippi. Did you Tell see that? Tell the in the church. Did you, you were born, born in Mississippi. Did you see the chewing tobacco dripping from her mouth? <laughs> oh. I know it. She and was, I saw the snuff right there. In, in, she was in bigger than him. Too. Really but, like she's just come back from a rodeo. I guess that Tommy's rodeo. Well, you know what? You better get ready for Miss Renee. Is Can you imagine that snuff? You're going to have to kiss her, Lola, with that snuff dripping oh, down her lips out of that lipstick. Mixed with Let's red take a break. Take a break. We're, we're gonna have to talk about this. <laughs> I love it. What about the new scuffling hillbillies? Let's take a time. <laughs> oh, you think you've really done something? We'll be back. <laughs> The 
heroes, the villains, the legends. Clash of the Legends 2. 20 July 1st at a Soto City Center. Free fireworks given away. Live music entertainment. Gold ticket holders get a free barbecue dinner with the legends. The legends. Clash of the Legends 2. Tickets on sale now for Clash of the Legends 2. Friday July 1st at the State of the Art DeSoto Civic Center. The Legends return to Memphis Wrestling for one night only. Friday night July 1st. Start a new era. Don't miss it. 58% of Memphis Chevy buyers buy from Bill Hurd Chevrolet. Why? Price. And the best selection in the Mid-South. Bill Hurd Chevrolet, the number one Chevy dealer in the Mid-South. Check us out on the web at BillHurdOnline.com. Love your car. Well, I can't stop <laughs> now you can love your car insurance too. New Allstate Your Choice Auto Insurance with deductible rewards and an all new safe driving bonus. Allstate Your Choice Auto Insurance. Are you in good hands? What's up, dog? Yo, you a money tonight, dog. Money. My man. You did. I heard you've been running around all night. Let's see lunch. Looks like you could use a cold one. Ooh, that's one lucky dog. You could be a lucky dog, too, at Southland Greyhound Park. This Saturday night, it's our crowd-pleasing $10,000 spin and win giveaway. You could be one lucky dog and win your share of $10,000. That's Southland. <laughs> Once you try a tasty, fresh, toasted Italian BMT sub from Subway restaurants, you'll forget everything else. Check out this hot, fresh deal from Subway restaurants. Right now, get any three regular six-inch subs toasted hot inside and out for only $7.49. For a limited time at participating Subway restaurants, Subway, eat fresh. 58% of Memphis Chevy buyers buy from Bill Hurd Chevrolet. Why? Price. And the best selection in the Mid-South. Bill Hurd Chevrolet, the number one Chevy dealer in the Mid-South. Check us out on the web at BillHurdOnline.com. Stinks in here. Timmy, have you got any of that room deodorant? You know what? What is this? Uh, what? Step out here. Come back. What, Give me Art? Story, Mac. You know what? Don't start you know spray. I don't here. want to don't smell that right here. guard. Go ahead with that. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Get that stuff out. Stop spraying that Corey. stuff, Art. I, I wonder if it's a hip. I think it's Corey. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, I'm telling you. Take your hot dog and shove <laughs> it in your mouth. Will you don't do that? Don't get physical. You signed a contract before we went on the air that said you do not get physical. If you want to get physical, oh, Jimmy and I man. will knock your teeth out, right? Well, now. you guys signed a contract the same thing. You can't well, get physical. We're to supposed to sit here and do I'm not done. No, I'm trying to get him to shut his big fat mouth. Why don't you shut yours or either open yours? Mouth of the people. South certainly ain't got any smaller. Homer Sheldon Ford Clash of the Legends 2. I'm not talking to you anyway, Lauren. Like Forget you. Homer Sheldon Ford Clash of the Legends 2. Friday, July 1st. There it is. Look at the name. Billy Wick. Sputnik Monroe, you guys hadn't talked about that while you're running your shop. What about the Midnight Express? I know you all are all excited about that. Dennis Condry, Bobby Eaton, Midnight Express, PYT, yep. Pork Chop Cash, and Coco Beware. Rock and Roll Express is going to be there July 1st. <laughs> Bill Superstar Dundee, what, Did Art? I get a word in that twice? No, you can't. First family members, Coco Beware, Norville Austin, you know, Pork Chop Cash, the list, you know. You Lance know. Russell, <laughs> Dave Brown is going to be there coming up. Of course, the good Joe. What about Big Phil Hickerson? And of course, you heard from Dirty Dutch Man Tail that signed the beat down to the Civic Center. That's not all. The list goes you, on and on. They goes on and on. Jimmy, some of these other guys that claim to be legends as far as managers go. Jimmy Cornette. <laughs> We're going to talk to him a little later. Downtown <laughs> Bruno, Nate the Rat. All these guys. Oh, they, my they, they couldn't hold a candle to Jimmy Hart as a manager. What hey. about Dwayne Peel is going to be there? Buddy Everybody Wayne. knows his yeah, buddy okay. Wayne. Oh, buddy my God, I'm bringing my hot dog. Derek Calhoun. Oh, my goodness. I heard Buddy's hanging around with Oscar now. Look at handsome Jimmy. Oscar Meyer. Handsome Jimmy Boogie Woogie, man. Let's go. We're going to tell you more right now. Let's go back to you. had a tribute to Lance and open the vault to Memphis Classic Wrestling. Here it is right here. It's BYT Express in action. And the old Michael Jackson Thriller jacket. First family. First family member. Oh, The great Ox Baker. Now, ladies and gentlemen, introducing the greatest team in the history of the Express. 
Russell will say one thing. You hear Harley Davis out here talking and running his mouth, talking about he's got a big mouth. You know, everybody knows Harley Davis got a big mouth. You know what we're going to do? We're going to stuff that motorcycle boot down his mouth. You understand that? We're going to stuff it, that boot down his mouth because we have showed them boys for the last two or three times that we're the best. There are no class for the PYT Express. You have, you have to convince the demons, them. Baby, the demons. I'm going to tell you, baby, you never seen nothing in your life like the PYT Express. We're the hardest item around here, but for that fact, we're the hardest item anywhere. So, Harley Davis, I'm going to tell you one thing. You big and you bad, baby, but you can be had. We done showed you in the past what the PYT Express is all about. It's all about. You can't talk to me. I'm going to tell you all about You've got enough to worry about with the fabulous ones. You know what, Lance? Right I want to say this. If my granddaddy even knew that we wrestled this piece of trash, he'd turn over this grave. Man, you That's got right, it. baby. That's right. I'm going to show you what we're all about right now. Now, you can make believers out of a lot of people if you can do anything with them. Tommy Wildfire Rich and Eddie Gilder will be going right against the PYT Express. And that bout is coming up right now. Didn't take him long to hit that ring this time, Dave. Right for the ring, the fabulous ones in there, the PYT Express out of there. What a fight they got one. Here. Oh, go ahead. That's what we came oh, for, Jim. Yeah. <laughs> all right, Dave. Let's go ahead with the introductions, and maybe we'll be out of all the jackets and the shades and all that stuff by that time. It'll be one fall, ten minute time limit. Total weight four hundred thirty-seven pounds. Norvell Austin back on his feet, over to the corner, and the PYT Express slowed a bit here by the fabulous one, Daddy Gilbert, now facing Stagger Lee. Back in the corner, the, boot, the right fist, who threw the first punch there, Jimmy Hart? And the second one, Stagger Lee, right fist. Daddy Gilbert reverses and out of the turnbuckle. Down to the mat. Who was in the way right there? Cal, who was right in the way? Who, who threw the first punch there, Jim? Norvell Austin coming back in. Tommy Rich in there. Boy, having some words. We're going to have a clean scientific method. Look at Tommy Rich. Look at that heathen. Look at him. All of them in the ring. Tommy Rich, Norvell Austin going at each other. Eddie Gilbert and Stagger Lee going at each other. Look out, Jimmy Hart. Grab by the hair. Tommy Rich blasts him. And Hart kneeled with the right fist. He steps into the ring. And referee says, ring it. Hart in the ring has grabbed Eddie Gilbert out here on the floor. It's Stagger Lee and Tommy Rich. Now they roll Tommy back into the ring. All five of them in there, Hart in the middle of the ring. While Stagger Lee is holding Tommy Rich, Hart beating on him. Eddie Gilbert working on Norvell down on the floor. Hart leaps off the apron, but Eddie nailed it. Look out. Over in the crowd, Eddie. Going back after Norvell down here on the floor. <laughs> back into the crowd. Eddie Gilbert, Norvell, Austin still working on each other. Hart holding Eddie Gilbert up from behind. Rich and Stagger Lee going at it across the way. Rich and Norvell back in the ring. Eddie Gilbert, but everybody back in the ring. We've got a free for all going there. Oh, the referee nailed by Stagger Lee, Jerry Calhoun.
Down on the floor, Rick throws Staggerly over the top rope. Grabs a chair. Frustrated with high-priced internet providers cleaning you out? They charge over $20 a month for service that should cost half of that. It's time you tried People PC Online. With People PC Online, you get unlimited internet access for only $10.95 a month. Go to PeoplePC.com now to try us free for 30 days and compare us with your current ISP. People PC Online has all the features you'd expect from the big ISPs and a few things you might not, like virus blocker software to help protect your computer from harmful email viruses, more local access numbers than AOL, and a smart dialer for faster, more reliable connections, all for just $10.95 a month. No wonder over half a million people have switched to People PC Online in the last year. To try us free for 30 days, go to PeoplePC.com for a quick download of our easy-to-use software or call one 800 Four six four zero nine seven nine. People PC Online, a better way to internet. How long would I like to live? I don't know. Late thirties, early forties. While my kids are still young, that'd be a nice time to go. Right before my daughter's wedding. A couple of months after Ed retires. Eleven days before my first grandson is born. Not finding time for a breast exam is like saying you don't have time for life. Stay tuned for an amazing free Stop Smoking offer. We quit smoking together. I don't think I could have stopped without it. I quit just like that. With maximum strength cigarettes, you will quit, guaranteed. I thought I was going to go nuts wanting a cigarette. I never did. Cigarettes was easy. It just worked. Other stop smoking methods can eventually cost you hundreds of dollars, but we're so sure cigarettes will work for you, we'll let you try it free. You get a 30-day supply of maximum strength cigarettes, free, plus minty anti-craving gum, and we'll also send along a 30-day supply of smokers' vitamins. That's almost $100 of proven stop smoking power, free of charge. I did it for the family. The kids wanted me to stop smoking. Hey, do what I did. Pick up the phone and call this toll-free number. Call 1-800-406-0202 to order your free 30-day supply of cigarettes, your free 30-day supply of anti-craving gum and vitamins. Credit card required for shipping and handling. Call now. Oh, what about that match earlier with BYD Express? Uh, coming? Where's They're going to be... The what about it? What are they doing with Michael Jackson? I want to I, I know what... Uh, Poor Michael can't get a break for nothing in the world. I bet you playing that. After Michael Jackson's big thing this past week, all of a sudden the PYT hey. shows up with the gloves. What do you mean thriller. poor Michael can't get a break? He hey, had what? the biggest break of his life. Hey, he said I planned it. I didn't have no young kids over at my house. What's wrong with you, hey, Poor Michael? Michael I Jackson know, I wanna, don't start that stuff. Are you going to bring Michael Jackson to this show? I'd love to have Michael Jackson. Well, he's not going to be he here, so why talk about it? Let's talk about who is going to be here. I'll tell you who is going to be there. My buddy that's standing by right now. I want to hear from him, Dave Brown. Do you guys remember Dave? Do I remember Dave? Yeah, well, of course. of course I remember Dave. Well, Dave's going to be when there. When Dave tells you that the sun is going to shine, get your umbrellas out, ladies Oh, that's right. ridiculous. Don't let Dave. I'm telling you right now, just consider the source out there, ladies and gentlemen. Lord, it's just the kind of stuff. Let's roll. Here's Dave Brown. You almost poked me in the eye, but that's him. What? Hit him. Hit him. And in those days, uh, back at Channel 5, Lance and I had been together for, for those 25 or so years. I don't remember exactly what it was, but it was about 25. But the time came that uh, Lance had an offer to move to the Atlanta Wrestling Group and uh, be a part of this huge international promotion. And he left. He went. So there I was all by myself. We needed a, needed a co-host, and Jerry Jarrett came to me and, he said, uh, you know, he said, young man, Lance has been working with him quite a bit at the Mid-South Coliseum, and we think he might be a good co-host. You, you think you could work with him, and, and uh, you guys do this together. And he told me who it was, and I said, yeah, sure. Well, I knew it. A guy named Corey Macklin, and uh, I often wonder whatever happened to Corey, where he is to, oh, what? Because he's about two feet away from here. 
<laughs> Come on in here. Let's talk about this just a minute. <laughs> Stand there with a stopwatch and all that stuff. But, How uh, are you? <laughs> good to see you. <laughs> good to see you. Uh, we had some good times there sitting in that studio at WMC. And oh, man, a bunch of great times right there at Channel 5 for so many years and uh, I heard you mention a couple of weeks ago how you were uh, giving your hats off to Lance for oh, giving yeah. you an uh, opportunity in this business. Well, my hats off to you, Dave, for taking well, me and taking me under your wing, a young guy like me that uh, didn't know anything about wrestling. I was a fan, but I knew nothing about the holes. I knew nothing uh, about the business whatsoever, but I just wanted to be there and get an opportunity to sit there in that chair next to you and uh, get a chance to sit there where Lance used to sit. And I'm telling you, uh, you did a great job in those days in filling Lance Russell's shoes. I don't well, think anyone else in this business could have done it. And I'm not just saying it because you're standing here. I've always said that my entire career. No one else could have taken Memphis wrestling to the next level of where we went to if it wasn't Dave Brown. It was appropriate, it was fitting, and it was terrific. Well, we had a good time. We, we sure did. We had some good talent with us in those we days, did. especially in the, really in the wrestlers uh, who, who – uh, without uh, the wrestling talent, of course, we're just sitting there talking, kind of like we're doing right now. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> but uh, we had a lot of big names. You know, one thing that I had a great time, and, and I had a good time, uh, had good relations with all the promotion all the way through, from uh, the Nick Goulas days, uh, Nick Goulas and Roy Welch in the early days, through the Jerry Jarrett days. Oh, yeah. and, and uh, um, But I had most fun with a guy that I still talk to every now and then. He's totally out of the wrestling business, totally out of the television business now, uh, but but a great guy. Went through some tough times, but came through it and, and is doing great. We're talking about Randy Hales, he lives mm -hmm. up in Missouri now. Yeah. But Randy put together Power Pro Wrestling. I sure did. And, and you and I, I remember we doing a promo pretending we were fishing. <laughs> I'll never forget it. And we caught exactly as many fish as we really would catch <laughs> if we were really fishing. Zero. <laughs> Zero fish. But anyway, we had a, we had a we great time. We were actually time. out in the lake land the lake. over the lake sitting there on the promo. Yeah. And but, uh, invoking the name of Bill Dance. That's right. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but I'll never forget, you know, Mason wanted wrestling back. Mason yeah. Granger yeah. wanted wrestling back at Channel 5. And uh, I remember Mason talked to you and he talked to Randy. And Craig Armour was yeah. uh, was also part of that whole group. And we were able to come back and, uh, and put that thing together. And boy, it was fun. You know, one other guy I want to mention uh, before uh, we wrap this up here is a guy who who spans several wrestling generations over the years. He, he was always a, a great, great friend. And he was a wrestler. He was a promoter. He was a guy that would go to all the towns around the area and set it up on Friday nights or Monday nights or Thursday nights, whatever it was. And uh, he, he would sometimes set up the chairs. He would be the concessionaire. <laughs> I'm talking about Eddie Marlin. Yeah. Eddie Marlin. Eddie what a great. what a terrific guy Eddie was. And over the years, talk about a hard working Another man. Another hard working man. Another hard working man and a talented guy. And he was uh, he was just uh, one of the people that uh, that made all those years great. So, he was. Uh, thanks to he him really too. Was. Hey, we're uh, I, I've been doing far too much talking the last few weeks here. <laughs> it's almost time to get uh, things into action. It's, it's we're not time. too far away from uh, July one and this big legend show and. Um, I, I am really looking forward to seeing some of the old timers. That that's another a great thing about it is that over the years I've been able, even though I don't get to see them much, I've been able to see a lot of these folks who I still consider friends. Right. And, and that bug on my head is not <laughs> one of them. But uh, anyway, uh, that's uh, something I'm really looking forward to seeing some of these great names again. Well, most definitely. Well, I know everybody is going to be excited to see you. It's been a pleasure having you here week after week, just bringing us some short excerpts. We haven't stole you yet from anywhere. <laughs> 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 so you can still look for Dave over at the station doing the weather every week. But it's just been terrific taking a moment. want to thank you very much. I'm sure all the fans want to thank you. It's been great seeing you here each and every week. And I'll see you, buddy, July 1. The heroes, the villains, the legends. Flash of the Legends 2. Friday, July 1st at the Soto Civic Center. Free fireworks given away. Live music entertainment. Gold ticket holders get a free barbecue dinner with the Legends. The Legends. Flash of the Legends 2. Tickets on sale now for Clash of the Legends 2. Friday, July 1st at the State of the Art DeSoto Civic Center. The Legends returns to Memphis Wrestling for one night only. Friday night, July 1st. Start the new era. Don't miss it. Looking for the best deal? Shopping the paper for the best price on a new car or truck? Play it smart. Take any print ad on a new Ford and simply put Homer Skelton's name on it. Because their ad is Homer's ad. That's right. 
Take any ad for a new Ford to Homer Skelton Ford and Homer will beat it by at least 250 Guaranteed. Whee! Largest selection, lowest prices. Every ad is Homer's ad. Look in every paper you can find. Take their good deal to Homer and he'll beat it by at least $250. Homer Skelton Ford always saves you more. Need a part pass, no time to pull. Tight on the deck, don't be no fool. Get hooked up with just one call. Pick up the phone, call Dennis Hall. Dennis got body parts, motors, and trannies. No soaking around every nook and cranny. For the hard parts, take my duration. Foreign and domestic, he got connection. Get hooked up with just one call. Pick up the phone. Just call me. That's fun to listen to. WDIA. How long would I like to live? I don't know. Late 30s, early 40s. While my kids are still young, that'd be a nice time to go. Right before my daughter's wedding. A couple of months after Ed retires. 11 days before my first grandson is born. Not finding time for a breast exam is like saying you don't have time for life. As the rising cost of health insurance left you without protection, you're not alone. Effective immediately for as little as $129 a month, your family is eligible for a quality association health plan that can drastically reduce the cost of doctor visits, hospital stays, accident coverage, emergency rooms, even vision and dental, plus a powerful prescription plan. You can't be denied, and it's so easy to enroll. For small children, we need to see the doctor often. With the plan I chose, now I can afford to. I'm self-employed. When I broke my arm, the bill was $1,800. With the Select One Accident Benefit, my portion was only $100. I'm on a fixed income. With my plant prescription card, I save on my name brand drugs and generics. I even save money on my glasses. Plus, I can have a qualified physician evaluate my health records, ask me questions, and prescribe medicine over the phone. Join today and use your doctor, dental, and prescription benefits immediately. All ages accepted. You can't be denied. Call now. Can you imagine a world without children? A world where children don't play, or dream, or imagine. At St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, we're working every day to find cures for diseases that strike down children. Because we can't imagine a world without children. Can you? Finding cures, saving children. St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. Call now or log on to stjude.org. Here we are back on Opening the Vaults. Look at this. The music that made Memphis King. Look what at this, What a great baby. book that is. Look at this. Come on, get a close-up of this. Look. Get this. There's two cameras shoot here. Look, George Clark. There's three cameras, Look. all right. There's the mouth of the South, Jimmy Hart. Jimmy Hart. Right here. And you With know his what? mouth wide right open here, as usual. And you know what? What we're going to do is I'm bringing out a good friend of mine, Steve. Fowler. Yes. He's got a great, oh, great musician. Group. Uh, soul Outsiders yes. are going to be he there. Probably played Fowler. on a lot of my, a lot of my records. What are you doing with a bunch of soul guys anyway, King, Art? Please sing one number with me that night, please. You've got to okay. come up. Uh, come on. Renee, you gotta, you've never actually Renee, seen you him singing. Saying? He's great. He's awesome. But we're going to do Cinema Girl, Keep On Dancing, Monday Night Memories. Yes. And also, for Lance Russell, we're going to bring Lance out, tribute to Lance, and we're going to do Lance Russell's nose. Can you believe that? About, be a, go ahead and eat you some popcorn. popcorn. That's about be stale good. now. <laughs> it's gonna be great. It's gonna be a great night. It's about as stale as it's you are. Wrestling Art. and music. Oh, I'm. I can't wait. You know, here's the other thing I want to ask you about very quickly. Handsome Jimmy Valiant. Handsome is, Jimmy. I thought he retired. He Did retired. Not retired. Handsome Jimmy is coming out of retirement. He's gonna make a special appearance on July 1 at the Soto City. I'll Center. put him back into retirement. Oh boy. Heart. We got some action of you in the ring with Andy Kaufman. You remember those what days? What about my music? Have you got some of the gentries on here? Too? Not right now. We don't want to hear. Let's open the vault. Let's go and open the vault for Memphis Classic Wrestling. Here it is with Jimmy Hart in the ring, and you'll be surprised. Some of the other stars that all came to fill out in this whole thing. Take a look. I keep on Here 
Here, Jimmy Hart and Andy Kaufman have gotten together. And Hart, always fearful of that physical abuse, pushes Andy Kaufman into the into the fray, shoving Kaufman out front. You run out of the ring and leave me there alone without apologizing. I listen to you, that's what I get for listening to you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Listen just a little bit more if you don't mind, if you don't mind, Mr. Hollywood. So I said, we'll count to three again. Maybe he didn't hear me. I gave him the benefit of the doubt, right? Okay, I go one, two, three. I charge back again. Laura likes to knock me in the middle of next week. I look back at confident. He's looking at his watch over there. So the backwards heart, that's what happened to me. You run out of the ring, you count to three, you say, go at him. I go at him, he gets me in a pile driver, heart. Come on, heart. You are You're crazy. such a chick. You see it the way you want to see it, Paul. You, you see it the way you want to State of the Art DeSoto Civic Center. The Legends return to Memphis Wrestling for one night only. Friday night, July 1st. Start a new era. Don't miss it. We're having fun now. Weekdays at 3 on UPN 30. Nobody rocks like Rock 103. 103. Classic Rock Authority, Rock 103. 103. 103. Are you an adult on TenCare? If so, this message is for you. TenCare is changing, and some adults may lose their coverage. If you've received a white TenCare envelope with brown forms inside, fill out the forms immediately and mail facts or take them to your local Tennessee Department of Human Services office. If you don't get your forms to DHS within 30 days of the date of your notice, you could lose your TenCare. For more information, call 1-866-311-4287. This summer, the world goes to war, and Steven Spielberg's War of the World, starring Tom Cruise. Watch you be in 30 Monday, beginning at 3, for your chance to win. Each pass admits one. War of the Worlds, compliments of UPN 30. WREC. Andy Kaufman is a, uh, like a 145-pound uh, television actor. And, you know, he's coming around wrestling and thinking uh, or dreaming of being a wrestler. And I'm going to show him, burst his little bubble, so to speak, about uh, uh, fantasizing about being a professional wrestler. Show him what it's like to be in there with a real wrestler rather than just women out of the audience. Would you like to hurt him? I think I have to hurt him. Okay, we are back. And are you excited that the, you're going to get to hear Jimmy Hart sing and me yes. sing? But I'm so excited to hear you sing. King's oh, going to be with be me. Great. I love this. Great. Now, you know what? We talked about how I have made so many people stars, and one of the biggest stars in entertainment today would have been a nobody. He would have His show would have probably lasted about six months, and then he would have been canceled and off the air. Wait but instead, he's become a late-night legend, thanks to my appearance on his show, that, by the way, went on to become one of the most 100 most memorable moments in the history of television. Well, you can true. go to the Museum of Television that's History true. in Washington, D.C., and they have this clip right there. And we're going to show it to everybody here today. I'm talking about, of course, David Letterman. 
Me and Andy the Kaufman. Slap. Well, you oh. finally slap. you finally told the truth for once in your life. I guess you might as well take credit for Jay Leno's show now. You're gonna take credit for David Letterman. Uh, let me see. How did I make Jay Leno a star? Well, no, my, actually, I guess I guess you made Bob Barker a star too on The Price Is Right. One of my favorite people. Oh. Bob Barker. That's right, Bob Just Barker. Because you were on the Bob Barker. Yeah, he was I was on, on the, the Price Is, is right, right, and I won something too. Yeah, what's so funny? What did you win? I won a big, nice cherry cabinet. That's great. It was so big it didn't even fit in my house. At well, the time. it wasn't this watch. I'll tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> and then, he, but the only stipulation was he had to come home and have all his dogs neutered. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, spayed and neutered. Okay, what are we going to do? Take let's a look. Something. Let's go open the vaults of Memphis Classic Wrestling. Let's go in the vault, open it up. Here is Jerry Lawler, Andy Kaufman, and this is classic, classic footage. Jack Eaton standing by to kick it off. Here it is. <laughs> and they are about to get him on the stretcher to be transported to a hospital. I'm sure they'll want to run a series of x-rays. The TV comedian spent three days in the hospital as a result of the match with the King. They next met on the David Letterman Show, where Kaufman, still in neck brace, continued to antagonize Lawler. Andy, why did you do that? That didn't seem, uh, <laughs> seem like a very nice thing to do. There. Um, I don't see how uh, uh, you could get, a person could get so mad from that. I was playing bad guy. That's what I was doing. I was playing bad guy wrestler. It was a role I was playing. I wasn't serious about it. I don't take things like that seriously, like, I am a star. I'm for, you know, um, that was just a role I was uh -huh. playing. Yeah. You know? So in, in your in your estimation, Jerry... And he and, and, as, and I think that he just was taking it too seriously. You think he owes humor. you an apology? Look, I, I always said you didn't, you didn't have a sense of humor, and uh, here the people are all laughing at it. Mm -hmm. So it proves my point. Yeah. Um, and I, that's why I came here. It was because I asked for an apology. I apologized for all the wrestling I've ever done, all the abuse I've ever given to people that didn't understand what I was doing. And I simply asked, think that apology is in order. So it's come to this, has yeah. it, Andy? You, you want Jerry to apologize. Uh -huh. uh, now, is this the way, uh, would that be an equitable thing as far as you're concerned? I don't think so. Yeah. Uh, I don't think I owe him an apology. I think, you, you know, he says it was all a big joke. Uh, I'm sure it was to him. I would you really? Because let me tell you something. My father said, my father said, my manager said, they all said that I had a right, I could have gotten a lawyer and I could have sued you for what you did and I didn't. And I just, all I want is an apology. Even you asked me last time I was on your show if I, if I was uh, going to have a that's lawsuit right. and yeah. I could have sued you. I could have sued you for everything you're worth. Well, and I didn't because that's, I'm not that kind of a guy. Yeah. Now, you know what, uh, what kind of a guy are you? <laughs> no. You're not kind of guy you. I'll just be over here. Uh, that's uh, we're going yeah, to you know, as far pause as here for station you know, I, identification and get the hose out here. King of wrestling. Thank you very much. Jerry Lawler, you're somewhere in a hospital bed right now, aren't you? You're sitting there and you're suffering. Your neck is in traction. I promised you a year ago that I would get even with you. I promise. It took brains, not brawn. It took brains. The two greatest brains in professional wrestling and the two greatest brawn in professional wrestling. Jimmy, you told me the Assassins were the greatest tag team. You were right. We did it. We all did it ourselves. I was instrumental and putting you in a pile driver, Jerry Lawler. Oh, and now, indeed, you indeed. see, I was not lying. Mike Mashburn is. The assassins come out of the ring. Lawler got up behind Andy Kaufman, nailed him right in the face. Pandemonium. They're trying to hold Kaufman down on the floor. Oh, boy, great footage there with Jerry Lawler. I got to say, uh... Lawler, you were a big name then. You're still a big what name. Do you mean, were? I say you're hit still it, a Jimmy, big name. Go ahead and hit I just right don't now. like the way you've done it, Lawler. That's what I like. I don't like. You know what I don't like? I don't like you associating with Jimmy Hart for one. And you know what? He's jealous. No, he's no, jealous. no, I'm not jealous. You know what I don't like? Because he's always tooting his own he's horn, jealous. talking about how good a manager. He's the greatest he manager that's ever been in the history Thank of Memphis. You. Well, I got somebody that begs to differ, and I'm not talking about Bob Bark either. And I'm not talking about David Letterman. But I've got somebody on the phone right now. He's one of the best managers that's ever been through Memphis wrestling. He went on to WCW, WWE, still a big name in wrestling, and I've got him on the phone here today. Oh, uh, hello, are you there? I am here, buddy. Jimmy Cornette. Oh I gave him my, my first knee pads. I gave him knee pads. Oh. Yeah, 
Hey, you know what he just said on the set here, Cornette, live on Memphis Wrestling, right here on television in front of thousands of people. Jimmy Hart says, oh, I gave him his very first set of knee pads. Oh, He's yeah, trying to yeah, I don't blame you, Cornette, and I, all I want to talk about, Jimmy, is that Jimmy Hart's out here tooting his own horn, talking about how a great manager he is, how July 1st he's bringing in all these big names, PYT Express, all of these original first family members, but I just wanted to just sort of <laughs> refresh his memory here today, Cornette, that, hey, there's someone else, Jimmy Hart, that begs to differ with you on being the number one manager. Hey, just because the Midnight Express is going to be here, is that Jimmy Cornette? Yeah, is Jimmy he taking Cornette. credit for the Midnight Express? Yeah, Dennis Condry. Tag team in the history of wrestling, and they're coming back to Memphis as well. And you know, I'm not promising, but when the Midnight Express goes, Jim Gordon's generally around, and I may be hiding back in the back just in case somebody like Hart tries one of his tricks. I'll be there. Hey, Cornette. Can, hey, Cornette, can you hear me? Can you can you shut him up for just a minute? Hey, Cornette, what? Jerry, what is it, Law or what? He wants to talk about. It. He's the biggest ripoff artist ever. The first Express was the Rock and Roll Express. That they will tell you that I created them. Then Cornette comes along and rips them off with the Midnight Express. Hey, you know what? No, King, King, I beg to differ because after all, I'm bound to your greatness. You are the king of Memphis. However, I think you got puppies in your ears. <laughs> We should hang up on him. Hang up on him. Jimmy Hart, you know take what? control. Hang up. Cornette was always number two, and you know what number two is? We're not the first loser. Uh, hold on, Jimmy. Cor loser. Jimmy, hey, you are you there, what? Cornette? Just hang up. Hey, wait a minute. Lord. Hey, come on. No, I'm not hanging up in his face. Hey, Jimmy I'll Cornette. Mace you. I'll mace you if you Thank you for joining us here today. Oh, Jimmy, we'll see you on July 1st at the Soul hey. Civic Center. You're supposed to. Hey, don't spray that, that stuff. Hold I told you before, I don't want to smell. Oh, Give me this stuff. Get away from don't don't spray that me. Don't you dare touch me. I don't want to hear that spray of the stuff. What are you doing? Look, you just. You ought to look out, Lawler and, and Renee. The new scuffling hillbillies, Grady Watts, his whole family, they're coming down from the hills of Mississippi down there, and I got a feeling that they're going to take care of business on July 1st. And just look at them. Look at the look in her face. This is supposed to be a night of legends, and you're bringing in a bunch of hillbillies? Hey, yeah. all of the people from Mississippi that are going to be coming to the match are enough hillbillies, and you're bringing in more. July 1st is the Homer Skeleton Ford Clash of the Legends 2, the Soto Civic Center. Hard, right, you better look out, too, before one of them wrecks this that thing upside down. This looks like the night of the living dead, King. Right, oh, gosh, oh, we're out of time. We'll be back next week for more of opening the vote. Will you stop Woo! frying that Woo! stuff? I'm out of here. Until we'll see you next week. Bye-bye, everybody. I'm sick of that heart. Don't get out of here with that. Come on. The heroes, the villains, the legends. Flash of the Legends 2. Friday, July 1st at the Soto City Center. Free fireworks given away. Live music entertainment. Gold ticket holders get a free barbecue dinner with the legends. The legends. Flash of the Legends 2. Tickets on sale now for Clash of the Legends 2. Friday, July 1st at the State of the Art DeSoto Civic Center. The Legends returns to Memphis Wrestling for one night only. Friday night, July 1st. Start the new era. Don't miss it. Memphis Wrestling, brought to you by Country Ford and by Cash Depot. Your station for Mike Evans and the early morning team. Devin Steele in the afternoons and continuous jams all day. I love these Sonic salads. Mm -hmm. You know, I ordered this salad because my body told me to. What else did your body tell you to do? Did your body tell you to wear that sweater? <laughs> Fresh taste salads. Sonic's got them, others don't. Drive in and try our flavorful Santa Fe grilled chicken salad or any of our other delicious salads. It's not just good, it's Sonic good. The heroes, the villains, the legends. Clash of the Legends 2.